Crazy Will here for another Crazy Will quick tip. All right, so I had a friend come up to me today and I'm making a video on this and I wasn't planning on this. If you forget your passcode on your iPad and you keep re-entering it, re-entering it, re-entering and you can't get into it, you have to factory reset it. And this is the way that I know there might be another way that you could go to the Apple Store and they could do but what you need to do is you need to connect it to iTunes and you need to factory reset. And I'm gonna show you how to do this. This is how it was delivered to me. It's raining out, so they were concerned. All right, so this is the iPad that's not working. And if you turn it on, passcode's been entered wrong, please connect to iTunes. What you're going to do is you're going to take the iPad, you're going to hold down on the home button and the power button while it's connected to your computer with a Thunderbolt. And I'm going to show you how to do that. I want to show you what I'm doing with the iPad first because this is probably the most important part and this is the part that probably most people get wrong and why they have to come see me. So what we're going to do is we're going to connect this straight into the iPad and you're going to hold down on the home and power button at the same time. So we got the home and power button and you're going to hold it like that and I think it's for about 10 seconds. I don't know until we see the the restore and iTunes pops up. Okay. So this is the screen that you want to see. And when you see that on my screen right now, you'll see a restore but this is the screen we're going for when you have this screen that means hey we're gonna wipe out your iPad and we're gonna start from scratch and now we'll go into iTunes and I'll show you what I'm doing it looks like this iPad was never updated so what we're gonna be doing is not only are we gonna be erasing all you know restarting it from scratch but we're also gonna be updating this iPad so we're gonna hit that please, please visit the website I agree okay so this is where we're at now and we're just gonna wait. So this is the stuff that kind of annoys me that Apple does. Um, they changed iTunes again, and I did this like a month ago, and it, cha it changed again. So this is where people get confused, and I, and I wanna point this out, and you may think I'm an idiot for, for this, because you know, if you're a tech guy, you would know this. Um, I got a little confused for a second, and I am a tech guy. I didn't realize what was going on. Now the screen's not doing anything. It's not giving you any real message. It is t saying iPad uh, recovery mode, iTunes is downloading, and then it has two buttons there, and they're grayed out. And you wouldn't know, but if you look over here, right at this little button right here, you'll see that it's actually downloading the newest operating system. And they changed iTunes, and like I said, if you're watching this at a later date, it'll probably be in another spot. But I just wanted to show you that so that way you're not super confused because for a second there I was like, wait, I've done this a million times. Why isn't this working? So, so it's been about 20, 30 minutes. iPad is done. All right, so we're, we're done from this point. This is not my iPad. I don't know why I named it me, but we're going to go back. And we're going to click right here and we're going to eject this now. Okay, so if you did everything correctly, this is the screen you should see, the hello sign uh, screen. It says hello, and it'll say it in several different languages. Do not be afraid of that. That is not bad. But this means it is reset, and that means we did it right. So now it's restarted from scratch. This is not my iPad, so I'm going to give it back to my friend. And how I'm going to do that is I'm going to hold down on this and shut it down so that way when they turn it on, power it off, they can set it up under their iCloud, under their username, and, and change the name and make their iPad theirs. So, we're gonna wrap it back up in their shopping bag. That was my quick tip. Um, I wanted to share this with everyone because I see a lot of people having problems with this. Remember your passcodes, people, because I can't tell you how many times I tried to help people and they're yelling at me because they forgot their passcode. Remember your passcode, write them down. Username, passcode, what it's for. You know, make a little, a little list. You know, you know. I, I can't wait to see my friend's face. She, she, sent, she, she actually brought this iPad to several other people before me. She didn't want to bother me. She, and, you know, she gave it to me. She's like, oh, I had a lot of people look at this. I don't know if there's anything you could do. And I said, I'll get it done probably in 10 minutes. And that's really all it took. I mean, it was mainly sitting on the machine you know, taking its time to, you know, what hasn't been updated. So it took its time to update and then also 
restore. So, I mean, 10 minutes of my time and she's gonna be super happy. You know, she didn't know if I knew how to do it and now she'll have a video because I told her I was making a video and she'll have a video to go back to and fix it if she needs to do it again. But hopefully she learned her lesson and writes the damn password down. <laughs> <laughs> if this helped you guys, it's a common problem that I see. If it helped you, make sure you like and subscribe. And remember, you can do anything you put your mind to. Later. You thought I was a picture, didn't you? Make sure you like and subscribe. Do me a favor already. <laughs>